much of You know, it makes yeah, them... Welcome back to my channel and this morning we're going to do our um, Sunday grocery shopping but this time we have to walk from our place to this marketplace because we don't have a car car guys and because um, what happened to the car but why why smash. we didn't have... had a smash <laughs> I ran into the side of a woman in a Mercedes after she ran a red light and so my bull bar is all damaged and they've it was supposed to take a week and it's now taken two weeks i was supposed to get it friday now it's going to be monday so let's see the good thing for about what happened to the accident is um that we had the dash cam on in the car oh yeah this lady hit his car well um it's, it's already a green light on his side but then the woman still still uh, keep going and I think she probably on her phone <laughs> oh for sure um, the interesting thing about that my dash cam it's a cheapy dash cam and often if it's been going for a while it'll it's not recording anymore and you don't find out until you you know we go camping or something and I want to get the um, video for going up the beach and suddenly you find out ah, it hasn't recorded but fortunately with this one I actually thought, oh, maybe the traffic cameras have got around. I thought of you know, calling police or something to try and get that. I think that's a bit of a hassle. I'll only do that if it's a real serious um, accident. But when I got home, I thought, oh, that's right, my dash cam. And I, I took it down. I went, yes, it's still recording. And so I got it. So, you know, because they may not believe you, the insurance company and whatever mightn't believe you if you don't have actual, actual proof. So fortunately it showed the green going, it showed this old fella walking across the road and um, and then it showed her coming in in front of me and if I hadn't have hit her, she probably would have hit the pedestrian who was crossing over just over the way, so probably a good thing that I did. So I'll show you the video of um, what happened to Ross car when um, that lady um, hit her. When you authentically make mistakes, which is not hard for me, but when you authentically make mistakes and just can kind of laugh them off and keep going, or you have tech problems, you just can acknowledge it. You know, it makes yeah, them feel like... Hey. And, and I remember there's there's one guy that's a, a internet marketer who's had enormous success on video, but he's like, when you watch him, you go, you know what, he's not that good. I think I can do that. And it, it, it empowers you in a weird kind of way. Whereas you watch somebody that's really slick and you go, no way I can do that. Yeah, I, I would just... We're here now at the market, so we'll have to start now our um, um, shopping. I think we have to go first to the Eggman. Yeah, let's go to the Eggman. Yeah. So we're done with our grocery shopping and now we're heading to um, our, have our lunch first before going home. So it's not too bad, it's not that heavy because um, we just um, bought what, what we really need for this few days until we get the car back. Oh, so this is so what we're going to have to be up for our lunch. 